this is a small white butterfly which is actually quite large but it's not as large as the large white which is really large it's feeding on bramble flowers this one's a large white butterfly and it's very large butterfly and uh, as I said the small white is large but this is way bigger and it's feeding on thistles and this is a buddleia bush in a field that has gone wild They're very good at seeding themselves they're non-native there look at that another large white butterfly that's a beautiful tree as well well a little tree this goes to show you how important brambles are because you can see there's a peacock butterfly feeding on them if you ever see a black butterfly it's usually because you're looking at the underside of a peacock's wings <laughs> just about see you wouldn't realize there are such spectacular colors underneath and they all love bramble flowers and it's from the bramble flowers when they get pollinated by these insects and the bees and uh, what will happen is we'll get blackberries in the autumn well, there's a nice bumblebee it shows the peacock's quite a large butterfly the peacock has to be careful too because there's an emperor dragonfly here that's him very big butterfly or a very big dragonfly kind of about the size of a paintbrush you know like a an artist's paintbrush very big and they've only recently moved into Ireland. I first saw one in 2003 and I think that was the first year there was a record and it was for Wicklow. And there's a pond hidden here with that huge dragonflies patrolling it but he's actually he's after butterflies. The first time I ever saw one he grabbed a butterfly and that, I was looking at a butterfly, a large white, and this huge emperor just grabbed him out of the air and landed in front of me and ate him head first. And the wings fell off like petals. They're petals on a rose. Well, it's gone past its best. And this is it, the East Coast Nature Reserve again, which is a very convenient place uh, to find a lot of wildlife. And uh, this is probably the best time of year because uh, this is the um, first week of August basically. Uh, so the first and second weeks of August are absolutely the best times to see insects and, and you see the most butterflies that's when the, the most are counted every year and the most species as well so here's our peacock again so here is the peacock so far he hasn't been grabbed He's having great fun feeding and on these uh, bramble flowers. And brambles are, in, are roses basically, they're a rose family. And if you look in the middle of the flower you'll actually notice like a green version of a blackberry, what will be a blackberry. And those petals fall off and then they'll swell and then peacock has actually landed on me somewhere on my hat oh <laughs> he flew off when I lifted the camera